Alright guys, so I'm making this video real quick. You have your jailbroken device and right now it's not really acting friendly. As soon as I launch up an application like the settings app, it's completely going to crash my device. So right now, I tapped on the settings app and it's not opening up and it's getting ready to crash my device. And right now I can't do nothing, I can't lock, I can't do nothing. And right now I'm stuck. You would think my device is messed up. But you can actually boot it into safe mode if you like. So on the iPhone 10 is volume up, volume down, and then you press and hold the side button. Um, same thing applies with the iPhone 8. So the iPhone 8 and iPhone 10 is the exact same method. Volume up, then volume down, and then press and hold the side button with the iPhone uh with the iPhone 7 is the volume down. I'm going to have all those prompts on screen somewhere. On an iPhone 6S, so you press and hold the home button and the side button together. So right now, currently, it's booted into safe mode. And really, this is just a non-jailbroken side. It's not necessarily uh, safe mode because safe mode would have been like you would have got that error message on screen. Now, Cydia is going to crash, uh, but you can launch your other apps. So yeah, this mode is good if you want to make a quick text or a quick phone call. Maybe you're in an emergency or whatever. Um, this mode is perfect. You boot your phone right into like the normal mode, and you can even take this to Apple. Just hide the city icon, and you could just take this to app, to an Apple store if your screen is cracked or anything like that. But let's say you want to be back into the jailbroken side. You want to fix that jailbroken side. You want all your tweaks back, but you don't want to update. Here's how you do it. All you gotta do is just go into the Electra app. So my Electra app is right here. And you perform the same steps, but this time, make sure this toggle is off. So um, turn off the tweaks toggle, and that's going to basically disable all the tweaks. I like to make sure Siri is off, so it is off for me. Uh, make sure airplane mode is on, and then just tap on re-able jailbreak. Now, obviously, it can fail one, uh, maybe one or two times, but give it that third time, and or that third try, and it should be back to normal. But this time without the tweaks. Okay, open SSH is open. So if you want to enable SSH mode, <laughs> if you want to open SSH mode, then that's how you do it. And yeah, so jailbroken. Let's launch back up Cydia. And now Cydia is enabled. So there you have it. I mean, this is your jailbroken side without actually having tweaks. Yeah, so now you have Cydia open. And now you just got to find that bad tweaks that's just messing up your device. Um, I like to install a tweak called Crash Reporter. I actually don't have it installed right now currently. And Crash Reporter is going to actually show you what tweak is bad or what tweak that caused the crash. Um, but if you want to start fresh all over again, you just got to uninstall um, Substrate. So Substrate is like the brain. That's like the whole entire jailbreak, basically. Um, it's not going to mess up your jailbreak. It's just going to uninstall all the tweaks. And then you can just start fresh again. Um, but I'm not going to do that. Um, but let's see what's going to happen, though. I'm doing this in real time. I haven't done, done this before, but I've been jailbroken for years. Now, if you get this prompt, all you got to do is just simply reboot your device. So I'm going to press the and hold the volume up, and I'm just going to power it off. Now, once your device is all booted up, let's, let's go back into the Elytra jailbreak. Okay, make sure that tweaks toggles is on. Airplane mode is enabled. Siri is turned off. Let's confirm that. Yes, it is. Now let's try this again. All right, let's try this again. As you guys can see, my tweaks are enabled. All right, let's try this again. If it mess up again, then, but we gotta go back into Cydia. So, yep, we gotta have to keep on trying. So right now it is messing up. So all you're doing, you just gotta uninstall the tweaks that you recently installed until this problem is all fixed. So right now, the problem is still occurring for me. So I'm going to pause the video, I'm going to repeat the same steps, and I'm going to let you guys know the update. Alright guys, so I didn't take really that long, just like about 5 minutes, and I found the tweak, so everything is running normal, um, I have airplane mode back on. Uh, so yeah, if you guys watched my last Jailbreak Tweaks video, do not install no slow animation. I'm going to take that off the list immediately because that tweak is still in beta, and beta tweaks is just never going to work out, right? Um, so it didn't work for my iPhone 10, but I just recommend you guys stay away from those kind of tweaks anyway, those fast animation tweaks. And I feel like I probably don't even need it anyway, because, I mean, so that's how you do it. No need to restore your device. Um, the only time where you have to restore your device is when you're stuck on the Apple logo. When you're stuck on, like, a boot loop or something like that, 
you might be in trouble for a little bit. But um, if you are stuck on that Apple logo, try holding up the power up button and holding the side button together because that can boot up into um, normal iOS. Um, but if that don't work, <laughs> you, you, you asked out. I'm sorry to say that. But um, if it happens to me, which it did happen to me in the past, but, but that's yeah. how you fix your jailbroken device. And I really do apologize if you did install uh, No Slow Animations. I'm going to give you guys my apology. Yes, I'm not responsible if you mess up your device, but I kind of felt bad because I recommend that tweak. It was going good, but then once they updated to beta 4, I was, um, you know, I was having some problems. And then, yeah, that's why I'm making this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I really, really, really do appreciate all your support. Let's slide over to the sub count right now. Currently, you guys are killing it. Almost 18,000 subscribers. I might be doing a Q&A, so stay tuned for that. I make other videos too, so not just jailbreak videos, just to spice it up a little bit, you know, change it up a little bit. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I catch you guys on my next video. Peace.